Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at installing Focal Board, a project and task management platform, on Linux. To get started, launch the terminal and run sudo apt update and sudo apt upgrade to install any available software updates. Next, we'll install the Nginx web server and MariaDB database. We'll elevate to a root shell using sudo su, then execute the MySQL secure installation script. Follow the prompts to set a root password and mitigate no MySQL vulnerabilities. Now we'll connect to the MariaDB database using the command line utilities. Then using SQL commands, we'll create a focal board database, along with the service account with full permissions to the new database. We'll flush MySQL privileges, close the MySQL connection, then exit the root shell. Using regular expression, we'll look up the download URL for the latest release of focal board on GitHub. Then using wgit, we'll download the latest release. We'll extract the downloaded files, then edit the config.json file in nano. Update the config to set the db type to mysql, and set db config to the updated connection string. Save the changes and close out of nano. Now we'll create an nginx site configuration file and edit it in nano. Copy the site configuration from the video description, then save the changes and close out of the editor. Back in the terminal, we'll remove the default nginx site configuration and enable the new focal board site config. Then we'll restart the nginx service for the change to take effect and create a new focal board service config file. Copy the service configuration from the video description, then save the changes and close out of nano. Back in the terminal, we'll reload the system services, then start and enable the focal board service we just created. Open a web browser and navigate to the DNS or IP address of the host. Click the link to create an account. Complete the form by entering an email address, username, and password, then click register. Welcome to Focal Board, running on your Linux device.